This is a Govee Smart Thermometer. Why isn't that just any Govee Smart Thermometer? It's the H5075, which Govee Support tells me supports uh, automation triggers so that you can use this thermometer to trigger these switches or lights or whatever. Similarly to the way you should be able to use this guy, little push button switches to trigger automation. So let's open it up and see what we got. Now they've got batteries in the sensor and it's working and hit the plus sign. Type in the model number in the search. H5075. Wait for it to connect. So we'll rename it to H5075. And we'll not worry about device security. That's all it took to get this temperature sensor configured in the Govee app. To upgrade the firmware on the thermohygrometer, select the thermohygrometer, go to settings. And you should be prompted to upgrade it. Once the sensor is paired, you can then pair it with a gateway. You can do that by clicking the gateway symbol and clicking on the gateway you want to add it to, add sub device, and the plus sign next to the sensor. You may go through a network test. Once you've added it to a gateway, go back to the main screen, choose automation at the top, and then choose auto run. Plus sign. And we're going to call this temp high temp. If the temperature is higher than 67 degrees, then the outlet on. So we'll turn that outlet off. To go on. Now that we have the automation set up, let's heat up the sensor. And there we see that the light turned on when the temperature hit 67 degrees. If you like this video, check out my Govee playlist where I've got quick setup guides on other Govee products.